Hey, so a couple of you guys have been asking about the uh, TCG Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Uh, I don't really want to get into these boxes because as I was doing my, my research, uh, I came across like this is like the most ex the hit card, basically. This is the card you really, really want. And unfortunately, th this card, you know, it's it's only f worth about 40 bucks. You can see it's a medium price is like your average price is 47 bucks. Market value is what most people would pay for this card is about $38. So if you're trying to pull this hit card out of a $100 box, and the chances of pulling this card is extremely rare, by the way. Like, it's like one in like 100 and 250 or 150 cards or something like that. So it's really hard to actually pull this card as well compared to any of the other, you know, hit cards. You know, your your specialty cards. So, I'm probably not going to go with this deck. I'm not going to go with this um, this set. This, Star this Scarlet and Violet set. Um, I might buy a Miriam, this card, which is really nice. And probably just, like, grade it. And go and sell it that way. Uh, but, yeah, I'm... I've seen some graded cards go for some crazy prices too, people. And I'll show you right now as proof. Some of you guys are probably like, yeah, right. No, for real. Take a look at this. 400 bucks for a graded. Let's go back. Oh, God. Here it is. Yeah. 400 bucks for a graded car. Look. 10 out of 10, $400. It's only valued about 150 bucks. You know, you can see the condition of it. It's pretty, pretty nice. Centering is good. Obviously, mint condition. Pulled from the pack. Put into a sleeve. Put into a top loader. Centering is spot on. So yeah, 10 out of 10 is 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 definitely, you know, recommended. Definitely worthy of it. But it's $400. Oh my god, a $150 card, bro. You know what I mean? Like, that's just insane. So, you know, because like, yeah, it's just way too much. So I'm probably going to buy one on here and then get it graded and sell it. So if we go to like the first page... And then we see this seller. He's he's this guy's Mike. He's got zero percent ratings and no sales. I don't really trust that very much. It kind of makes me nervous. So I'd, I'd probably go with near mint condition, forty dollars for Jester, at a hundred percent ratings for positive, and then twenty six for sales. I'd probably go with this guy next. Even though yeah, what's a couple of bucks? It doesn't matter because you want to have all this to be good. Okay. Quality over quantity sometimes, people. That's for sure. All right, people, I'll see you guys in the next one. Let me know in the comment section if you bought any new cards or anything new for your collection. And, uh, yeah, um, I'll see you in the next one. Peace out, people. Peace out. If you're new, subscribe.